tech enthusiasts and live streamers often struggle to find a versatile camera that can meet various needs and provide increased mobility in their streaming setups. As someone who spends a lot of time working with cameras, I find myself using multiple cameras for different purposes. Well, Ayoko hopes that their new 4K multi-use streaming camera might be the perfect option for you. This is the iCoco On Air 4K wireless live streaming camera. The On Air really caught my eye because of its impressive multifunctionality. It's not just your average streaming camera, it also doubles as a USB webcam and a standalone video recorder. The fact that it can shoot 4K video at 30 frames per second and 1080p at 60 frames per second means you're getting incredibly sharp and smooth footage, no matter the intended use. This kind of versatility is a game changer, especially for streamers like me who crave the flexibility to switch between different setups without having to juggle a ton of equipment. It's also great for those who want a camera they can take on the go with them, which can be used for filming both face-to-camera shots and outdoor activities. So the burning question is, is this product truly worth the ask in price? Well, let's first start by unboxing it. So depending on whether you go for the creator pack or just the camera, there is a selection of things you can actually get with this camera. If you opt for the creator's pack, we get a larger box containing not only the camera, but a two terabyte USB flash drive, 64 gigabyte micro SD card, a spare battery, and a corresponding charging dock for both of your batteries. When it comes to unboxing the on-air camera itself, we do get a mounting adapter, a carry pouch, USB-C cable, and your very basic user guide. Alright, let's dive into the design and build quality of the iCoco on air. Right off the bat, this camera is both sleek and rather solid, which I really do appreciate. Weighing around 300 grams, it's definitely got a bit of heft to it. While some might find this weight a tad much, I actually think it adds to its sturdiness and gives it a more premium feel overall. One of the standout features for me is the body being IPX4 rainproof. This means it's more than capable of handling a little drizzle, making it ideal for those impromptu outdoor vlogging sessions when the weather decides to be unpredictable. It's the kind of durability that makes you confident to take it out and about without worrying too much about the elements. On the left side of the iCoco on air, we've got this handy USB Type-C port, which is a real gem. You can use it to hook up the on air to your PC, making file transfers a breeze. Plus, it transforms the on air into a USB camera, which we will touch upon a little later. This camera runs on a hot swappable 3400 mAh battery, which is honestly one of my favourite features. Being able to quickly swap out a battery without having to shut everything down is a game changer, especially when you're out in the field or in the middle of a long shoot. It means less downtime and more time capturing content. Unlocking the latches to access the battery is pretty straightforward, and it's not just the battery you get access to. You'll also find the micro SD card slot there. There. Over on the right side of the camera, there's a 3.5mm O-port for connecting an external microphone. This is a big deal for me because good audio is just as crucial as good video, and the ability to plug in a high-quality mic directly is a massive boost for anyone looking to elevate their content. Whether you're vlogging, podcasting, or doing those live streams, the company really is setting this up to be a versatile piece of kit. The 2.4-inch touchscreen is another highlight. It's incredibly responsive and straightforward to navigate, which I really do appreciate. There's nothing worse than fumbling through confusing menus when you're in the middle of a shoot. With this touchscreen, you get quick access to all the essential settings so you can adjust on the fly without missing a beat. And let's not forget the dual screw mounts. These are perfect for a variety of tripod setups, giving you the freedom to shoot in portrait or landscape mode. Whether you're setting up for a standard vlog or trying something a bit more experimental, these mounts make it easy to adapt. The 180 degrees rotating lens is a game changer for me. 
Whether you're aiming for the perfect vlogging angle or capturing an immersive first-person perspective, this lens gives you the flexibility to nail any shot with ease. It is super versatile for all kinds of content creation. Just being able to go from a front view to switching around means you can maintain the full resolution without relying on two different camera modules. Really great idea. The Sony Starvis CMOS2 sensor really delivers, producing footage that's not just clear but also vibrantly rich in colour. This sensor is a beast when it comes to capturing fine details and handling a wide range of lighting conditions. Whether you're indoors in a dimly lit room or out in the sun, the dynamic range holds up beautifully, making your shots look professional and somewhat polished. The HDR video recording is particularly impressive, maintaining a balance in both the bright highlights and dark shadows. This is crucial for anyone serious about producing high quality streams or videos where you can't afford to lose detail in tricky lighting. Now obviously this doesn't replace a DSLR camera, but the footage is certainly up there with some of the other portable cameras like this. However, there's a bit of a downside. The On Air does have a tendency to overheat when you're pushing it hard with extended 4K recording sessions. If you're planning on doing long 4K streams or recording sessions, you'll definitely want to have a cooling solution like a fan nearby to keep things under control. It's a bit of a bummer, especially since the camera is so capable otherwise. But this is likely something they might fix in the future with updates, hopefully. When downgrading the image quality to 1080p with 60fps, we do get quite a difference in image quality, but this certainly could come in rather handy for those who work on 30fps timeframes and want to import footage they can slow down for a more engaging clip. But like I said, it obviously is a noticeable difference in image quality. On the audio front, the On Air impresses with its dual mic stereo directional audio system. The built-in mics do a solid job of capturing clear clear, balanced audio even in less than ideal environments. It's just great for spontaneous vlogs or live streams where you need to rely on the camera's internal audio. But if you're really looking to step up your audio game, there's that 3.5mm AUX input for external microphones, and I do recommend taking advantage of this. So this is the audio quality from the onboard microphone. I've got it set to omnidirectional. There are a few settings you can tweak if you want to. And as you can hear, well, it's not too bad for the price, obviously. But if you truly want to take advantage of some good videography, you are going to want to plug in an external microphone. One of the most thrilling aspects of the iCoco on Air is its rich suite of features tailored specifically for streamers. It's not just a camera, it's like a command center for your streaming needs. With the companion app, you get full control over critical settings like shutter speed, exposure, ISO, and more. This is a game changer for anyone serious about their content. Instead of fumbling with hardware or diving into complicated menus midstream, you can fine tune your video output with a few taps on your phone. It's the kind of control that makes your workflow smoother and your content look brighter. The On Air supports direct wireless streaming to a variety of platforms like YouTube, Twitch, and Twitter. This is a huge plus for me because it cuts out a lot of the technical headaches associated with going live. The setup is straightforward. You connect the camera via the app and it's instantly recognized as a video source. No messing around with cables or complicated software. You can be up and running with a live stream in just a few taps right from your phone. This kind of ease and flexibility is fantastic, especially when you want to share content in real time without a long setup time. But once again, because this is completely wireless and all you need, you have the ability to stream your 4K adventures live to your followers. Whether you're hiking through rugged landscapes or whipping up your latest culinary masterpiece in the kitchen. The ability to deliver high quality, immersive content directly to your audience, no matter where you are, is a massive selling point. It's not just about versatility, it's about empowering you to create and share your experiences seamlessly and effectively 
and Icoco has really nailed it. However, there are some quirks that can be frustrating. The wireless streaming mode suffers from a noticeable delay if running on a rather average connection, which can be a hassle when you're trying to interact with your audience in real time. Moreover, the camera does not transmit audio when used wirelessly, so you'll need a separate microphone setup, which adds an extra layer of complexity. This is something you do need to keep in mind. The camera packs a 3400 milliamp battery, offering around 3.5 hours of continuous use. And if that's insufficient for your needs, the battery can be swapped out easily, so it would be beneficial to get the creator's pack if you expect to go through a lot of battery life. So let's break down who the iCoco on Air is really meant for. If you're a content creator who demands reliability and top-notch quality for both indoor and outdoor streaming, this camera is a game changer. Its ability to handle wireless streaming seamlessly and deliver high-definition video makes it an invaluable tool for vloggers, gamers, and anyone serious about leveling up their streaming setup. Now, if you're just starting out or your streaming needs are more static and indoors focused, there might be more budget-friendly options out there that could fit your requirements just as well without the bells and whistles. However, I can't deny the iCoco On Air is a standout choice in its price range. Its innovation and versatility in supporting mobility and high-quality live streaming, along with being used as a standalone webcam, action camera, vlogging camera, and so much more does really set it apart. However, it's not without its flaws. There are many flaws, as I have mentioned. The overheating issue during prolonged 4K recording and the lack of preset settings are definite downsides that potential buyers should consider. Despite these drawbacks, I'd confidently rate the iCoco on air. It's nearly perfect for serious streamers and or content creators who need something versatile they can use for more than just one purpose. With a few tweaks in future updates, this camera could easily become a must-have. And with that all said, be sure to check this product out in the link in the description. Let me know what you think. Till next time.